All right, guys, uh, this is the end. So I'm here to play. Well, definitely the demo came out. So Hokuto ga Gotoku, which many of you have been asking me to play this uh, in several comment sections. And I guess they finally came out. So before I start, though, this is this is the exact question I get. So what I do is I have you have to have a two account. OK, so you have to switch account. And I have my Japanese account here. If you don't have it, you have to create it. I'm sure there's tons of tutorials. But go to PlayStation Store, okay? And within PlayStation Store, you have to navigate to uh, Hokuto ga Gotoku Demo. For some reason, like, honestly, I think they should bring it, like, in the front. But instead, they're advertising Persona 3 and Persona 5 dancing all night. Um, Star Night or Moon Night or whatever. Um, but anyways... I think by the time you get to this video, or maybe like if you get to this video like a week later, two weeks later, things might have been changed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to search on top. Okay, right next to cart, go to search. And you might not, well, you, you'll probably get this, but this is Japanese keyboard. Okay, so you have to find a word ho, which is right here. Okay, ho, right above space. So hit that. Go to R2, okay, that's enter, and enter, okay. Then hit search button, and they'll give you a bunch of games that will start with H, okay. So I'm going to navigate, I'm going to go all these like a perverty games. Anyways, so keep going, keep going, and you'll find, okay, so a game. It's This is not demo though, this is just a game itself, and I'm smoking, I'm like really surprised that it cost 120 dollars for this premium edition version <laughs> that's crazy in japan game is not all the same price like what we have here in in america you know everything's 60 dollars if you have amazon prime it's like 50 dollars but here at japan it depends prices are different depending on what games they are but anyways so i come to this page go to bottom section of it uh wait so oh so right now my cursor is right on the pricing information, right? I go right, and that shows game page. So I go there, and that will take me into the game page where they have all these different kind of games related to this. So I go to the bottom section, and uh, scroll all the way bottom, okay? from So from this screen, I go all the way to the bottom, and they have a demo. This is the demo, okay? So hit X, then you'll be, you know, jump to here, and you can click that. I already have downloaded, so they don't show downloading. But you can click that button right here. Right here. Okay. And you can download. That's it. So every time I put up this demo, people ask me same questions. So I wanted to make sure that before starting the game, you know, everybody understood how to download the demo. So you can follow along with my gameplay if you don't know how to download it. So let's start. So now we have that out of our way. Uh, there's two options, okay? First is you can experience Hokuto Shinken. So this is the one on the top with the blue color coloring. And the bottom one is to experience the story. So we can do two things. If you don't know what if you don't know what the Hokuto Shinken is, if you don't know what Fist of the North Star, it's one of the famous older uh, anime we have in Japan. Really old. I think my volume's too high anyways. Um, so the guy in there with a the blue jacket, is his name is Kenshiro. He has mastered Hokuto Shinken. It's like a way of the, the fighting style, okay? Um, so he like hit enemy's bodies like a, a <laughs> body somewhere. And the enemy burst into blood and stuff like that. So you, I guess you can experience that. So let's start with this, and we'll do the uh, story after this. Uh, so this is the option if you want to make the, the blood visual mild or not. I definitely don't want to make it mild. I want it to have a gore, so I'm going to hit E. No. And then we'll start. Oh, very exciting. I don't know. I'll kill you. Die. Ha. 
Looks like 60 frames per second. It's smooth. Shin. Shin. I will kill you. For sure. Okay, so we come. Um, whoa. Okay. Uh, I definitely wanna, um, change the vertical thing. Yeah, I hate, I hate this. Like, I hate when it's opposite when you try, you know, try to look right and left. I gotta turn that off. Okay. Yep, that's it. So, graphic looks kind of cool. It's like, like a cartoonish, like a Borderlands type of graphic. It's not typical um, Yakuza game graphics. I mean, the character's moving very smoothly. I like it. Cool. Let's go. Let's go fight Shin. Oh, by the way, I haven't really uh, read the original comics. I know what it is. It's like, I might not be able to um, answer questions. Now you have to regret your revealing against us. Uh, so rush combo, you have to hit square to do rush combo. Uh, or you can do continuous punch by hitting squares four times, then mash the triangle. Or you can hit R1 to lock onto the enemy. Okay. Oh, you have to hold R1. All right. Whoa, that's rash. Oh my gosh. That is cool. Damn, I love this. <laughs> That's cool. What? Can I do sway? Ah, so I can do sway. So, I think that... Oh. Okay, why are you hitting enemy with a square? You can hit triangle to do high damage finish blow. Alright. Depending on how many times you have hit square, uh, the finish blow will change style. Alright. Uh, let's see. I feel like that's one of them, right? Uh, wait, so let's do three times. One, oh wait. One, one, two, three, four. Hmm. Am I getting different style? Whoa, did he just spin? That's cool. You can hit L1 to guard. If enemy do like a, the, the hard damage, your guard will break. And also you cannot guard the, the attack with knife. However, you will get less damage if you're guarding when you get attacked by knife. Okay. Alright. Okay. You can do sway with X. Uh... But... You can use left stick to um, decide which way you're gonna sway. Uh, it's very good. Better than guard, if you're good at it. Okay. Alright. Whoa. Okay. Timing is very important. <laughs> Dude, I suck. Okay, come on. Nice. Okay, so your health, upper left, you have a health gauge. Let me uh, disappear. So once you lose all the, the gauge, you will die. So always make sure you check it. When your life gauge is blinking in red, that means you're about to die. Uh, be careful. Uh, do you, okay, do you see that red star? That's like your death star. So if your health is low, that star is gonna shine red. Make sure you use healing item or eat something when you're low in energy. Uh, now kill the enemies with everything you have learned. Okay. This is by far my favorite, you know. Oh. <laughs> I hope this doesn't like require a special gauge to do this. Oh my gosh. I just... <laughs> oh, he's all black now. What happened? Oh. Does it mean he's dead? 
Oh yeah. Booyah. That's cool. Oh my gosh. The fighting is way like better than the the Yakuza game. Or at least to me though. Like it's fun. And I'm glad they spend a lot of time. Um, you know, not time but thoughts to this because you know, without a good fighting system, what this game could be. This game, this game is all about fighting. Oh, damn. Okay, I've learned uh, points. And your level went up. Okay, so there's five different points you can earn. Star, heart, skill, and body, and light. Uh, so the leveling up system is basically the same as the original Yakuza. Then. There's many ways you can learn these points. You know, not just fighting, but other stuff. So let's select this and we got the green so you can unlock these skills uh okay so ah uh, okay so this is when you're doing a special attack you can hit the circle so we'll try to use that so this is very important factor to level up your character. Um, okay, all right. Wow, I'm kind of pumped for March 6th. That's when this game is coming out. I better read the comic before the game comes out so I can explain it to you guys. Although you guys probably know already, but you know. Uh, okay. So when you're attacking enemies, sometimes they get knocked out. Uh, while they're knocked out, you can hit square, not circle, to uh, hit their special spots. Depending on how many times you attack, uh, circle attack will change. Okay. Oh. I want to see. I want to see what happened. What happened to him? Wait. Also, just like that. Oh, uh, okay. Also, he doesn't burst into blood then. I thought that's... Oh, they have auto mode. Where you don't have to hit circle. They automatically put the thing on. Okay. Sure. That might be easy. W when you attack enemy with circle, they lose their freedom. And while they're stun mode of losing their freedom you can do really special attack you better use that special skill attack more and more and it will get stronger and stronger uh okay well let's try that i don't see the uh okay i have to find the enemy we can do okay oh what's that <laughs> I missed it! Oh. oh my god! That is... That is great! Wow, okay. I love... I love it. Okay, so these... Oh, wait. Nice. <laughs> wow. I'm definitely buying this game. Okay, oh, come on. Hey. Hey, don't take away my opportunity to do this. Mm, that sucked. I missed the timing. Okay, oh, okay. So he's saying I have a special gauge with uh, seven dots. Okay, they call it Shise Gauge. Seven star gauge. Uh, while you keep attacking enemy, um, you know, stunning them, doing special attack, you get more gauge. Uh, okay. And when Ken Kenshiro, the main protagonist, has a blue aura, we call it heat gauge. Heat status. 
uh, while you're in heat status, your attack will increase. Uh, we can do special burst with double X. You can do special attack by doing double X circle to do jump kick. But there's other stuff you can unlock. All right. Uh, okay. Hold on. Burst. Okay. R2. Nice. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. What? Oh, yes. Oh, my emotion, dude. Yeah. That is like his signature um, phrase. Oh, my emotion, dude. That means you're already dead. Holy cow. Oh, you can change the target while you're doing like this, this blue thing. Oh my gosh. This is, oh, 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 ah. that sucks. Okay. Wow. Aha. Uh -huh. So I assume this is using Dragon Engine, right? Damn. I hope this game, like, story is really good. Wow. You know, I try to avoid all the fights <laughs> in real Yakuza game. This is, this will be one of the games that I don't really want to miss the fight because it's so fun to do this. Oh, is that his thumb in the enemy's eye? I mean, an ear? <laughs> Oh, guys, still suck at the timing game. Wow. I definitely can, can't let my kid, you know, play this game. There's no way. Really bad. He's, um... Ah! Oh, this is a new move. Oh! <laughs> How many are there? Wow. Damn, okay. I bet that's it. Shin. Shin. Been looking for you. <laughs> oh, it's you, Kenshiro. Why did you come here? Yurio Kaisen. Give back Yuria. <laughs> Yuria? Didn't you forget, Kenshiro? That day, your fiance is mine now. Don't say you forgot. I beat your ass. And you cried blood and tears in your own floor. That day. You couldn't beat me. And you couldn't protect a woman you loved. This result came because of you. You didn't die and you only got scar on your chest. You were lucky back then. Because Yuria tried to stop me when I tried to kill you. She cried and she said she will come with me. A bitch saved you, huh? I'll let you go now. This is my last kindness to you. Is that all you have to say? What? To find you. I came back from hell. You came here to lose once again? Stupid fool. Ho 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 ho. 
<gasps> oh, wow. Alright. You got some skills now. But, there's no way you can stop me. I'll kill you this time. Yeah, sure. And that's it, right? Oh, do we? Oh my gosh, we get to play this too? Yes, thank you. Sweet, we get to fight Shin. Okay. You know, I noticed. I don't think, I don't think Shin would call Yuri a bitch. <laughs> I don't know. Like I'm so used to the um, <laughs> other Yakuza game where they like use the word bitch or ass or fuck all the time. So I definitely have to um, you know, read, read a comic and kind of understand each character's characteristics. It's hard for me to translate without really understanding what kind of person they are. So I'll, I'll try. Oh my gosh, I'll try to read. You know, if I understand what kind of person he is, then my translation will become more accurate. So that's that's probably very important for you guys to get as accurate information as possible. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa, okay. Ah, I lost the circle. Oh, what? okay. Woo! I want to do a different one. Hmm. Okay, but he's almost. Whoa. Die! Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh. Wow. Okay. Oh, it's March 8th. Okay, I thought it was March 6th. Okay, so we'll stop here for now. Um then second part we'll do the the story demo. So that's it, and we'll just wait till March eighth to start the, the game. I'll definitely play this, you know, if you guys haven't read my comments yet. So I'll see you guys in the second part of the video. So don't go anywhere. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.